This is Jay on LA, and today we're going to talk a little bit about the homeless. So let's start with Lhasa and the count in February. Apparently, you've got a bunch of people who don't know how to count, or don't know how to input into the computer, or don't know how to get a really good app to work, but it seems like the numbers are flawed. Yep, the numbers are flawed. And why are they flawed? Well, you know, was it intentional? Let's see. So if Lhasa undercut the number, that would be good for them because then they could get off the hot seat and ask for more money saying they're doing a really good job. Or if they undercut the number because they just don't know what they're doing, then it only proves that they should be completely broken up and the city should have its own consortium to do it. And this makes absolutely no sense to continue the stupid behavior that we continue to do. Now, let's talk about stupid behavior. It's come to everybody's attention this weekend that the city of L.A. since 2015 has given back to the federal government $150 million in housing because they couldn't quite figure out how to house people with that money for long-term housing. Really? That's all you people have talked about. Mayor Garcetti, day one, I don't want shelters, I want long-term housing. Really? $150 million given back to the federal government when we're spending, as a city, a billion dollars a year, as a county, a billion dollars a year, and we're still increasing homelessness and having more and more problems out on the streets, and now we're actually pissing away money to Lhasa, who doesn't do their job correctly and can't even count. Can't get people off the street, we know that. So, isn't it time for maybe a federal investigation into the city of L.A. and its corrupt practices? We've had three council people either indicted or jailed. We have a county supervisor who has an office being raided, blaming the right wing. Well, let's see how well that turns out. We have a congresswoman running for mayor who potentially is involved in the scandal with the council member who was the county supervisor who allegedly did corrupt things to get his kid a job. Uh, isn't it time to flush the toilet? This is not a right wing. This is not a left wing. I keep reading Mike Bonin's diatribes on Twitter, you know, that the right is coming out and they're painting the left as bad. It's not the left. It's not the right. It's politicians. It's all you guys around the horseshoe. Mike, it's good you're retiring. Maybe you won't get caught up in any of this. But the reality is $150 million back to the feds, that's partially your fault and the other 14. So again, as far as I'm concerned, time to flush the toilet. You know, the homeless issue is never going to get fixed. It's never going to get solved with the people we have in office, not one of them. This is Jay on L.A.